Ah, dia nak gol. Oh, saya pun saya suka. Princess Rukia nak kita gula dia. How is the audio? How is the audio? The audio not good? Hey, good now? The audio good now? It's choppy. Oh, let me, hold on one second. Talk to me now, talk to me now. We must be good now. We must be good now. We good now? Tell me if we good now. Tell me if we are right now. Alright, so we good now, right? Uh, perfect. Um, so let me just put the um the link in the in the in the comment section. All right. So there's a link if you want to jump on on the live scene. Um. So so the big the big news, the big news. Everybody is supposed to know by now. The big news is uh is Sizzler basically um, showing his disapproval with um, with the plot that Khalid sent to him. You see? So we talked about it this morning um, over on Instagram. It's a massive, but there, there is always, there is always, in, in other situations here, there's always things where we, we can learn. So because always I try to study um, people's behavior. You understand what I say? Me always I try to study um, causality. Me always I try to study motives and the way how people function and the way how people think and see how it impacts the society at large. Is this the way how is this the way how our people them steer? Is it the way how is it the way how the society behave on a whole? Is it is it the, what what this with what this you know correlates to? Um you know is this the mentality of the people them? It's always something learning from them things here, you know. And this this thing that happened. Well, we, we woke up to this this morning. I just decided, decided the, the, the breaking news. I did, did have a life for you. I did have a life for you this morning for an a, a, a ex-policeman from Jamaica. Very interesting life. But it doesn't make sense to do the life there today again. I'm going to do it next week. All right? I'm going to do it next week. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna like that. You're gonna like that life. People them way. <laughs> yeah, some people are gonna like that life. Some people are gonna, are gonna eat it. But with the situation with Sizzler, right? We don't talk about it already. And we and we and we will think about it. But you know, you know what the greatest lesson we learn from this? We learn say. I learn more than one thing from this. I learn to see. I learn to see. I learn to see. Um, Jamaican people. I never talk about black people and all, or African people. Jamaican people. I learn two main things I learn from this. I know it already, you know. 
but them keep proving me. Them keep giving me more reasons. Yeah, to hold on to the the the, the narrative we may have about Jamaican people. You see Jamaican people. You have to be very careful of them. You have to be very careful of Jamaican people. You have some Jamaican in them at much love you show them, you know. You will sit down and eat and drink with them and everything, you know. You will have them as your friend, you know. And you see one little thing go wrong, them just show you them true colors. Them just show you them true colors, them just show you, say, yo. And that way I may really feel about you, you know. Not because me and you sit down and eat and drink. Not because me and you are quote unquote friends, are friends. Me. We kill you. <laughs> Remember me telling that, Reggie. Jamaican people. We kill you. If one little thing go wrong, you're not getting a second chance with them. You're not getting a chance to explain it. You're not getting a chance to... It's like them impulsive. Like you see how quick we tell a man about him, mother. Like as a man, this is what we just said. Hey, mother. Like as a man, this is what you just said. Let me chop in your face. Bam! Chop in your face long time. Is that man diss him, say, so boom, pop out your gun and shoot him. And a weird, we, we think that weird. You say, may I say? Yeah. Is that like a barbaric? In all honesty, we have some nice Jamaican people, you know, loving Jamaican people. The, weird, the weirdest thing about, you know, we show people crazy love, you know. But we snap like this. Bam! We just snap. Boop! And in that, moment, in that moment when we snap, but we do the most drastic things then. But we all go back and think, think about it after and say, yo, I should even do that in a star, but you don't know it's done, gone already. Sometimes we do some things that we can have explain why we did it. We can have explain why we did it. We just, yo, we don't even know a star, so many feel at the time. That's the explanation. Like, so why did it? Why did you do it? Yo, I don't even know a star. You see? You see all the Jamaican man them, the Jamaican man them, them and them woman all a reason. And the reason it just turned into a fight. <laughs> Jamaican people, me talk about my people them, because I not talk about nobody as I live with, I live around. Jamaican people, you will start a conversation and it start like, yeah man, they don't know what say. Messi am my baller. And your next virgin I say, Yeah, man, Ronaldo am my baller, you know. And the argument I go good, good, and you say, They don't know, say, Messi better than Ronaldo. And the man I say, Nah, man, I want to. Messi better than which Ronaldo? Ronaldo, I idiot. And you go say, What do you mean, Ronaldo, I idiot? And the man say, Then Ronaldo, no idiot. And you say, Well, you can't call the man idiot, you don't know the man. And the man say, Well, you can't call him idiot, them are idiot. And the man say, yo, yeah. And the man just say, yeah, idiot too. <laughs> the man just say, yeah, idiot too. And the man say, me, I call idiot. And the man say, then you're a bigger idiot. And the man say, bigger idiot, your mama. And it just start, go, go, and go, and go. <laughs> and then you look at the two man, the two cutlass. And you say, what, start, what started this? Oh, the man, the man, you have a ball game. <laughs> I want you to check out that man gone to the hospital, man not have no hand, man ears chop off, man dead. And you say, I was started. Your company seen in here, you know? I was go on. You were dead, the man them they are played them in one attack about Messi and Ronaldo and all of this. A man not... A man not say one thing and it just, it just trigger off everything a man say. Then you know, bigger idiot, you don't know, see all your woman, you think your woman are fucked for you because you're an idiot. My woman fuck for me. Then look what that, yeah. And that just trigger a whole thing and a big war start. But I look at two man a reason about ball game. You see what I say? We have a barbaric thing, Bowie. 
It's like we're very impulsive. Like if something not go away, we just think that we have to settle it with some form of violence. I see our society, our society love people. We're aggressive. Our society love people. Well, quick for fight. Our society love people. We're, we're bully. Our society love people where we have as bad man as Dan. We love them people that we glorify them people. If you, if you, listen to me. In our society, if you talk too nice, them don't like you. In our society, if you walk a, a real way, and you don't walk a deep, if you don't walk a bop, a man no rate you. A man say, yo, you don't walk a bop, you know. In our society, if you go dance and a man see a drink, a bottle of water, a man pre you and say, yeah, see that, you know. Pay water and buy when you come and dance, you know. See that, I mean, I mean, you know. Boy, I would even buy, I didn't know, say, yo, you don't even want no liquor. You want to be sober tonight and a man say, see that, you know. Water the boy buy, you know. Boy buy water. The time we go to the boy, the boy buy soft drink and water. See that. Them as eh? Them people yeah. You you would think you and them good? You would think you and a Jamaican good, good, good. See? Until one thing happened, and them just start telling you everything where them never like boy. you. Them tell you everything when them think about you for the past 30 years, 20 years, 10 years, 5 years. You say all of this time, and I say it feel about me. Hey, a real man, real thing, you think some man don't know you see a long time. Man knows you see a long time, a man real thing, a real man, real thing, man, come on, come on, man, come on, man, man, do your things, you know. I say, yo, you feel them weird about me every day, may you see them and reason them here. You feel them weird about me, you come on, I'm a yard, Reggie. You feel them way about me and me about me, you them around your bedroom. So when we see people do things, you know, we look like extreme. It coming like nothing to us because we're so desensitized towards extremity. Where when we see it, it come it it, it, it it's like nothing. We're so desensitized to extreme behavior. When we see it, it's like nothing. It's like, yo, nothing. I don't know what You see what I say? It's not nothing happening. And that is the reason why you would have find all a man like Futa Hype. After Sizzler did what he did, you'd have seen a man like Futa Hype come forward and glorified it. A man, Futa Hype said, yes, the, the lion finally wake up. Welcome home back, lion. Welcome back, welcome back, lion. Because foot type, other type of man, they too. You and him with their good, good, good. And in my opinion, he will just snap and just chop off your head. And you think, say, you and him be good, in my opinion. Yeah. And a mentality there. That mentality where people glorify extreme behavior. Because anybody with any form of rational, you know, critical mindset would have seen a behavior like that and say, yo, that extreme. What that I do? But Sizzler do. Sizzler, we Sizzler do extreme. But here I would justify that now. Here another way I would justify that now. I mean, say we, can, we, 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 it's like we stay so. We can't help ourselves. I'm more something else, man. We justify behaviors, extreme behaviors is like. I'm more something else. You see, we can't just look on it and say, I either think that enough. And that right you know. No, we say. It must be something else. The other party did. We can't just accept the fact and say, yo, that wrong virgin. No. So what we do, we do it in our homes, we do it to the children, we do it to the friends, them, the family members, people we like, especially people that we like. When we see them do something, the first thing we jump and say, 
Him not go just do that. I must suck my else. I must suck my else go on. We don't just condemn the behavior, you know. No. We don't condemn the behavior. See? We basically say, you know what? I don't say nothing until me find out what really go on. All when them see evidence and everything, you know, even uh, in the situation. We hear Sizzler say, Colin never put him picture on the plaque and him can't hear the same name and him send the wrong plaque. We don't hear nothing else, you know. So if there is even something else, you know, that is not what is important here, you know. What we are listening to is not somebody saying, call it send the wrong plaque, plaque you know, to Sizzler, you know. We hear Sizzler himself has said, call it violating because he no send the right plaque, he send the wrong plaque, he picture should have upon it, and he can hardly see him name. Those are the things that he said in the video. He said, take off the baby because the baby innocent. But Khalid violate the thing and are him billing. Are him possible. You know, you're nothing else. Why was we now have contemplate and I said, no, Sam, no, I said, no, let me wait until me you will really go on. <laughs> what more? No, you're, you're hoping that the person can come forward now and give you a reason to justify the behavior. And so we stay in our home. And so we stay with the children. Them, you want to find out what really happened, so you can tell your fitness. It's all right. Go and go bed and brush your teeth. It's all right. We can go on here. Me know, say so you would have never do that. You know, deal with the situation mm -hmm. at hand. You see, you have to go wait until one story come. No one, the, the, the somebody have time to go make up something. And when the person make up with them, make up. You decide, say, oh, see, me did know some enough to believe them enough. And me did know, say, I him trouble him. So, you yeah, wait now. Before you, you hear the man say what happened, the man tell you what happened. You see what happened. Here we know. And me say, we. You really have to, to say nothing, you know, because something bigger there. there. You see? There's an underlying issue. Something more than that. Something deeper than that. Why? Because we can't just find ourselves to get to the point to say, and the wrong way that we approach is something, you know, and that is uncalled for and that never necessary. We can't find ourselves to do that. We want something to justify that behavior there. You see? We always are looking for something to validate a behavior. No matter, no matter how it is presented, and we can see it and say, yo, yeah. Nothing can make you do what you do. Nothing, me not see what reason, what, what reason you can't come give me if you do what you do, how will you do, how will you do, how will you do. It's like a man thumped on a girl, beat up a girl. You see the man beat up a girl. Zin, here you know, I must something should do why the man a beat her up. You would even look into it and say, yo, it's a big old man that why you beat up like a girl there. Eh? No, you have to you have to get to the you have, you have, you have your program. Your program for things say, no man, I must something she do. Make him a kick her down so. No, sir. Me not me not say nothing. Because me not know what she do. Cause she must do something why I'm a kick her down so. That's our mentality, people. That's our mentality. So the man we the, the look at you, the man them we see out the note on murderer. And the man them we see abuse women and them something here. I find them little them stay so I get away with it. I find them little them I get away with it because as she did do it, I him did start it. And oh, wait, 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 go and go sit on them. You see me, I say. So that's the reason why you find so much people now, they're on the internet, and they might justify this type of behavior. You see? And you go talk anything now, where against, where them, where them, against, feed them stance on them tech? Then we kill you too.
Kimbali said, but I fit in plaque, so if him want to burn it, burn it. And not our plaque. How many tell the man to do with him own a plaque? May I send Hannibal for you? <laughs> May I go send Hannibal for you? I swear I'm going to send Hannibal for you. Hannibal, where are you? Kimbali over here talk foolishness. I swear I'm going to send Hannibal for you. <laughs> We see if I can send Hannibal to you. Yeah, man. Hannibal needs to come for him. Yep. So, a person named Clover Ford and a commenter. Me see, can I see, may I read some of the comments and learn how them people are really think? So, a person actually went in, in details or went deep with her analysis of the situation. And listen to our mindset. Listen to our mindset. Listen to this mindset. Well, just an FYI. Y'all think they came here seeking to, en seeking to endorse the music out of mere love for it? No, that's because reggae music has transcended into other genres such as Afrobeat and reggaeton and even soca. That industry is exactly what's transcending and that's where the bugs at. Rap is too competitive and predictable right now. The material they're rapping about is stagnant. It's a bait and switch capitalistic and exploitation world. So why are you all surprised? It's obviously getting richer meaning DJ Khalid, is obviously getting richer of the industry while throwing meatless bones to your artists who have no representatives versed on entertainment, laws, and contracts. Y'all need to educate yourselves on the industry or y'all definitely will stay getting exploited. And people is actually cheering that on. That has nothing to do with what happened this morning. No, no. That's how that's that's what we call that's how we call classic ad hominems. Nothing to do with whatever happened this morning. No, no. But of course, our mentality, you see, we do something wrong and we can go dig up a million things to justify why the wrongs that we did is okay. Or why the unacceptable behavior is okay. Oh. Hey, I don't know, I don't know if, you, if, if, if you kill one of them. Because them all is a thief anyway. I don't know if you, I don't know if you want to fight and kill one of them. Because the government go on a gun. So there's a person who got in a details about exploitation. All kind of sitting. And robbery and all them something there. Zin. Failing to understand that that is not the man's issue. That is not the man's issue. Because I am quite sure. I am quite sure that if that man felt like he was being exploited, the man would have stated that. The man, you know, see no information of the man saying he was being exploited. The man tell you what happened. But no, 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 no. Because you know what? If we accept, say, that, that really happened, we are going to be forced to admit, say, the behavior was extreme. So we have to go around, no one dig up, no one go down, so no one find this, no one find that, no one one million something. Is what I say? Is a, is a mentality. We have been a point out that man a rap the music, a man a this, a man a that, a man a exploit music. Like full time now, I tell the man say finally wake up. The man have a problem with voicing music for Khalid. The man not said that. The man have a problem with royalties. The man not said that. The man have no problem with even Khalid put 
somebody in our video we into we not support the lifestyle the man never said that the man tell you say the plaque never have him picture him name is too small you see that the man issue is so we can round the world and up the world and down the world can find out what else happened so we start guess what we start do we start put forward our assumptions out there and we start see what can stick what can stick what can stick what can stick oh him couldn't just lick her so i must something she do what can stick oh i mean here say she did run at the bathroom and she did spit pan him what can stick oh as a matter of fact she kicking him seed what can stick oh that now stick oh let me try something else and them just try what can stick what can stick what can stick it's like years ago a little girl from olaba her ex-boyfriend held her down and raped her right held her down and raped her and people heard her screaming heard her crying yeah she was like she was going to school at the time i think and you know what the people in the comment sections over the internet are the 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 the, the, the different platforms you know the people in comment swear they might look a young girl i be a cocky then i be a man then you don't know why them totally Turn them mind or shut down them mind. Or shut down any other feelings them can have for the victim. The fact that she was crying out for rape and saying, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Y'all remember that? The, the, the girl that was saying, don't kill me, I want to go back to my mother. Do not kill me. And him had the knife. And she said, put on the knife, put on the knife. Me are begging to kill me. Me are begging to kill me. Now, a, a, a regular human being, you know, you'll feel some form of Compassion, you know, feel some form of, you know, you know, sympathy in that situation. You hear the girl like cry. She said, "Don't kill me, me a beggar, no kill me. Me want go home back to my mother. Please, no kill me. Do me a beggar, no kill me. Right? Put on the knife, no do, do. And then you hear the man a rape her. And you totally shut out all of that out of your system. And I focus on them. I look a young girl. I be a big boy. Them one. Our mentality that you see what I'm saying? It's, it's like a mind, it's like a it, we, have, we have such a messed up mindset. Like we look for things, we are wait for something else just to be said, all right. Me see enough now, me can't say it wrong. Yeah. And they would justify that with, yeah, but if me don't know everything, why me ever call it wrong? <laughs> Yeah, me don't know everything. Me haven't know everything before me say it wrong. You see? So you can't say it wrong, and if you get inf additional information, you say, you know what? Based on what you put forward, what I saw was wrong. You can't do that, you know. You can't get to the mindset for say What I saw and what you presented in the initial <laughs> stage was wrong and is wrong you see so now that you present other information i'm having a change of, a change of mind or change of thoughts or i still hold my position you can't do that you're free of mind somebody say but you did say the person wrong you see i know you can't come work you want to change your mouth so you can't say wrong when you say wrong because them them train me from we are baby from we are pitney if you say where you do make him beat you? Where you do make him stab in your eye with the pencil? What you did make him rape you? Why you get beat up? Or that every woman with the on the road, or are you him choose to beat up? Or that every woman we are walk up and down on the road, how comes that you him choose to rape you? You see? 